What is up guys, my name is Chase. Welcome back to a new video. I am just having the most stressful week of my life. Let me show you guys. Coco, did you pee? I think you peed. Is that pee? That's totally pee. God dang it. Now the other dog is barking. So in case you guys missed it, this is Coco. She's our newest puppy. And she has been a pain in the butt, not gonna lie. So this should be at least a little bit of a decent little video because I do actually plan on doing stuff today. I have to go out and run some errands. The dog keeps crying, I hate it. Not that I hate the dog, but I hate the fact that she cries. By the way, here's the other dog. Say hi, Yuki. Say hi to the internet. Anyway, so I'm gonna go run some errands right now. It's honestly gonna be so great to finally have a break from taking care of these two puppies. I love them, don't get me wrong, but they have been quite the handful. Yuki's been okay though. She helps to show what the little dog should and shouldn't do. Anyway, let's go outside and be very cautious because there is quite a bit of stuff going on outside in the world. I'll be back, okay? I gotta go run some errands. Coco's breath usually stinks, so I think we need some kind of breath thing. I don't know what she would want. Check out her squirrel. She likes this kind of thing, which might be good. This one's six dollars. Hey Yuki. We made it home, buddy. All right, look. I got you some surprises. Okay, let's see what I got you. I got a ball. Do you like this ball? Look. We got this elephant guy. What else did we get? This little chew thing. She's starting to chew a lot, so that'll be good. We got a little koala bear. The koala bear we got on sale. Coco, that was on sale. I got that for a good price for you. Last thing we got is this little fox. Sweet, that's awesome. She's all about that ball, which is good, because that means we can use it to kind of tire her out. You know, she can go chase it. Awesome. She wants to go downstairs though. And I can hear Yuki downstairs. She's starting to get kind of anxious. Here, go play with your sister. Actually, here. You probably gotta go potty, right? Go potty? So if you guys are wondering, originally we weren't gonna let them play together and stuff. Basically Yuki, you know, she doesn't go outside very much. She's more of an indoor dog. She's basically very safe and like there is basically no chance that she would have caught anything and she would be able to spread it to the dog or anything like that. So we basically think that it's safe for them to play together. Although right now, whenever I do leave the house, as you guys saw, the little one does stay upstairs and Yuki stays downstairs. Yuki is like literally three times the size of Coco. <laughs> they get along pretty well. Anyway, I've pretty much done everything that I need to do outside for today. I got some lunch from Jack in the Box. I honestly don't go to Jack in the Box very often, so I'm excited. I actually got something new for once at Jack in the Box. I got the fish sandwich. So I guess we can do like a little taste test here in this video. The sad thing is that like, Coco has started to kind of take over a lot of Yuki's stuff. Like, you know, like she's playing with her toys and whatnot. We're very, very lucky that like Yuki is really chill about everything basically. You know, the first time we introduced them together, Yuki was very, very good about it. She's been doing awesome. She's a great little pup. They haven't gotten into any fights or anything like that. So thumbs up for Yuki. All right guys, so here is the fun part of my day when I get to eat lunch. <laughs> so I got myself the new fish sandwich from Jack in the Box. I, for one, actually really like fish sandwiches, you know? I mean, I guess the only like fish sandwich I get regularly is like the filet -O fish from McDonald's. So that's kind of what I'm gonna compare this to. I'm gonna go full on food reviewer here and actually talk about the aesthetics of it. We have lettuce, we have fish. The fish is significantly smaller than what you would get at McDonald's. I'm also interested to see the quality of fish. I got no tartar sauce because I'm not about that life. So anyway, cheers. 
it has a very different, I guess, texture than you would get at McDonald's, which might just be the fact that the patty is so much thinner. The best way I can describe it is that like this tastes more like fish than McDonald's. Although because the fish is so thin, the lettuce kind of takes over it. Yeah, like the fish is a lot more tender than the one you would get at McDonald's. So yeah, it's interesting. It's not bad. It's pretty much what I would have expected from it. I don't know if I really like it more than the filet fish or not. I think I like both about equally. I think it's like five bucks or something. So for that price, like it's not bad. I also got a medium Sprite. I mean, look how big this freaking Sprite is. It's literally the size of my head and I have a big head. Anyway, guys, I'm gonna finish my lunch. So that's what I thought. I don't know. <laughs> Coco, come here. Coco. Look at that dog. Then look at this dog. <laughs> I'm honestly just excited for her to get out of the puppy phase. Not only because it means that she'll stop peeing all over the floor and she'll also be able to sleep during the night, but mainly just because I'm excited to see these two dogs play together. I think they're gonna be like best friends. See, like Yuki's really chill about it. I love it. He's such a good dog. Honestly, maybe expect more of these vlogs just because I do have to take care of this puppy so I don't have as much time to make videos, which I don't know what I'm gonna do about because I do have to work on my senior project for school. So if you guys like this video, feel free to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and hit that notification bell. For now, my name is Chase, and I will see you guys again soon. Bye.